Hey guys, time for one more unboxing video before my market on Saturday. We're going to be, excuse me, vendor event on Saturday. It's not a market, it's a fall harvest festival in Petakodiak on Saturday from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. I will be there. I will be outside. So regardless of any restrictions or anything going on, anybody can come see me. Spread the word. If anybody needs any Epicure, I'm going to have hopefully enough on stock. I guess it's a really busy market, so I'm hoping I have enough. So thankfully this came on Wednesday. And it's, uh, for the most part, all new products from the fall winter catalog. I wanted to have as much of the new products on hand as I could. Um, again, these are the Epicure shears that are in the catalog. They are amaze balls. Um, again, we use them for everything. Let's be real, mostly for opening boxes. <laughs> but yeah, we use them for cutting up everything. So, and they're very solid, they're very secure, they're obviously not dollar scissors. Alright, so first off, um, this is part of the September host special. My last video said it was the September host special. I was wrong. Very wrong. It was the August host special, which is completely irrelevant now. Um, but these are mini bunt cake molds. I'm not sure. Little bunt pans, silicone molds. What I love about this is that um, if you let it cool a little bit, just pop it right out. Apparently it was gluten-free products, which of course all of the Epicure products are gluten-free, but uh, they say to grease the pan a little bit. Um, I never have. It's rare that anything sticks. I do make protein pancakes in my waffle mold. Well, I guess protein waffles in my waffle mold. Um, I'll mix up the batter and then I'll pour in frozen berries and then I mix it in the waffle mold. I don't know if it's the berries that's sticking or just the um, batter itself, but it does stick sometimes. Got to get it out just the right temperature. It's kind of a science. But uh, yeah, that's part of the September host special. You still have time. We can do an online party on Facebook. You just, I create the Facebook page. You invite all your friends from across Canada. And then every few hours, I'll post something, keep the conversation going. People give tips and ideas, ask questions, whatever. Goes on for usually a few days. And uh, we're running out of time. Normally, I would say maybe a week, but we could do it three or four days. And at the end of it, close it off, put the order in, you can get the September host special. So I got a Prep Pro scoop, two tablespoons. I got another one. It's backwards on the camera, so it's probably going to come up backwards on the video when I post it, but you get the idea. Two tablespoons scoop. And oh, I got it kind of quick. I got eggs cooking on the stove. I got a timer. Set. So, I got another buffalo wings seasoning and guacamole. This is all stuff I'm going to have all of it on hand at uh, the uh, Harvest Festival on Saturday. More guacamole, cheese, chives, and bacon, uh, lemon dilly. This is part of the Extraordinary Trio, so I will have at least two sets of it with me. Another cheese, chives, and bacon. I can break it up, but if anybody wants the Extraordinary Trio and want me to hold it for you, let me know and I'll set it aside. Three onion dip. Cheese, chives, and bacon. Bruschetta. That's brand new from the Fall Winter Catalog. And... That's the one quarter prep pro scoop. scoop. You saw it uh, in the last video. It's also, again, new from the fall winter catalog. Ah, see, I didn't have any of this before and I got some now. Home style chicken stew. A lot of people are raving about it. They're loving it. I can't wait to try it. I like making stuff from scratch. I like making my own stuff. 
And I like making chicken stew. I don't do it very often, but this will uh, prompt me to make up a batch. Pumpkin spice loaf and muffins. I think that might be part of the September Ho Special. Um, I'll post a picture of the September Ho Special on my Facebook page again. Homestyle chicken stew. I got a bunch of uh, chocolate pudding packets that I'll have on hand, chocolate fudge for the bakers out there. More chocolate fudge. Pudding, pudding, I'm not kidding when I say that, a bunch of pudding. Some of it might be for us, but you guys come first. I'll sell it first and then I'll keep what's left. Chocolate pudding. Um, it does work with almond milk. Uh, I you, I have tried making the um, store-bought pudding with soy milk. Doesn't work. Doesn't gel at all. Um, almond milk works. Almond milk works with this. I don't buy soy milk anymore, so I wouldn't know. But I do know, I can tell you, that if you don't consume dairy and you have almond milk, this will work. Chocolate. Bliss brownies. Oh my gosh, please come buy this stuff. I really don't want to bring this home in my house. Because people ask me to make it and I'm weak. So I do. And I don't want it in my house because then I eat it. Chocolate pudding. More brownie mix. Butter chicken. We love the butter chicken. Actually, that's a really good idea for supper tonight. We love the butter chicken around here. We don't eat out very often anyway, so I've learned to make at home what we used to eat when we ate out. More crispy chicken. It's not spicy. Um, it's got a it's very mild flavor. It does have a flavor. We do like it. I made it in the air fryer with sliced up chicken breast, so it is really good. Oh, Cheddar and jalapeno cornbread. Love it. Made it once. Um, the first time around with the recipe, I usually screw it up. So, of course, I forgot to add the cheese. Uh, love cheddar and jalapeno cornbread. Needs cheese. So, I tried to mix it in after I put it in the oven, but it just turned out to be a mess. But it was still really, really good. Go figure. Citrus lime no-bake cheesecake. Huge favorite around here. Again, please buy it because if it's in my house, they'll make me make it and then I'll eat it. <laughs> and I can't be eating that stuff. Carrot cake, I know for a fact that's part of the uh, September host special. So the carrot cake with the mini bunt pan. I say that with such confidence. The last month I did the same thing in the last video and it was warm. Hearty beef stew, very good. It is a bit on the strong spicy side. Uh, some people have said too much pepper. You can use, start with a quarter of a pack, half a pack, and then if you want a little bit more flavor, add it from there. Some people love it just the way it is. Use the whole pack and they love it. Maybe people aren't putting enough vegetables in the pot, in the slow cooker, and then it's overwhelming spice. Maybe add more potatoes, meat, whatever. So mix it up, I made it. We really liked it, so I think next time I would probably put three quarters of the packet though and my slow cooker was full. You can use it in the pressure cooker or slow cooker. More crispy, crunchy chicken. It's like a shake and bake. Honey garlic meatballs, huge favorite. It's doing very well. Crispy, crunchy chicken. This may be the same one I showed you. Cheddar and jalapeno cornbread. More cheddar jalapeno cornbread. More cheddar jalapeno cornbread. Another thing that I want you to buy so I don't bring it home. Um, let's see. Creamy pesto parmesan chicken. I have to sink my teeth into that. Everything again is gluten free, so if you have any uh, concerns, don't worry about it. It's front page, first page. As soon as you open the cover in the Epicure catalog, it's a whole list of uh, Epicure's never ever. Chicken fried rice, sweet banana bread and muffins. 
I think that's the other thing from the September Host Special. Crispy and crunchy coating, more of that. Chicken fried rice, hearty beef stew, honey garlic meatball, hearty beef stew. <laughs> I stocked up. Spicy crunchy chicken. Oh, caramel sauce. More caramel sauce, good. Glad I have some of that on hand. Honey garlic meatballs. So again, this is almost all, almost all of this is uh, the new fall winter catalog. There's some regular stuff like the uh, caramel sauce and the chocolate pudding and the fudge. And of course I have mac and cheese and uh, other things. Hearty beef stew, chicken fried rice, honey garlic meatballs, honey garlic meatballs, hearty beef stew, creamy pesto, parmesan chicken. It comes in a three pack, I believe, so I'm probably gonna have to order some more just so I can sample it. Uh, and also, speaking of which, when you're at the event, you're at my table, you can either buy it as a three pack or buy one of each. So if you want one of this, one of this, and one of this, and it's all the same price, three packs are usually $11.25. There are a couple of exceptions, but you can mix and match. Uh, honey garlic meatballs, creamy pesto, and another citrus lime. So, thank you for watching. Like and please share my video. This could be my career in the next six to eight months, depending on what the government has in store for us. So, uh, like and share. Um, yeah, get the word out. You can order directly from my website and ship directly to your home. And uh, yeah, come see me on Saturday and clean up my table. Hopefully I have enough stuff. I guess it's a big event. So come early before things are sold out. All right, thanks. Bye.